What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming. We are here in what? The Prison of Elders? Yes, level 32 Prison of Elders, my friends. I am on the grind to get every single exotic in 310. And I'm going to show you guys how you can do it as well. All you need is three of coins and some time on your hands. I'm going to show you guys how to get this done in six to eight minutes. You will have a chance at three potential exotic drops and you will have a chance at up to four strange coins at the end in just six to eight minutes pretty damn cool and i'll tell you guys exactly how we do it so as you guys can see level 32 prison of elders had my three of coins popped up and that was the first boss the oversized minotaur and i got an exotic chess piece that later on went to be the crest of alpha loopy at 310 light level keep in mind your light level has to be above 300 for exotics to drop at 310 light i made a video on it go check it out um my past videos have been pretty helpful in terms of getting your light level up or getting raids done or guides and all that kind of stuff and with the hard mode coming out in just a couple days there will be so many more guides on exactly how to do it now this is the next boss um the big eyeball is what i like to call it this is a pretty good uh, cheese spot. You're not invincible in this spot, but it's pretty safe. Uh, it's level 32, guys. There's really no need for a cheese. But I like showing you guys these things just in case this comes around as a harder difficulty later on. Um, but keep in mind that uh, it doesn't matter what your light level is. You you can even use the Gallahorn. My friend Candace, he was using the Gallahorn during this because it's year one. So the Gallahorn is so pretty effective. Um, but this is the second boss and then you can use your three of coins on this boss as well now you guys are probably like hey snipes you probably don't know this but the three of coins got nerfed and you can't do it every single boss well this is pretty cool how this is set up what it does is the first round is an ultra boss the second round is waves so there's no ultra third round is this boss that you see here fourth round is waves and fifth round is is another ultra boss so it actually gives time for the cooldown for the three of coins which is so cool and what i do is after i kill the ultra boss which we're about to do here then we and if we don't get an exotic or even if we do get an exotic i just pop the next three of coins right away so it's pretty cool how this works six to eight minutes you can get four strange coins and three exotic drops from it i'm going to be completely honest with you guys this time when i did it all i got was one exotic drop but I got four strange coins, some modes of light, and some other cool things that, that you'll see at the end of the video. Which, hey guys, that's worth it, man. Because honestly, if the exotics that I'm getting, and so far I've gotten four, and I've only been doing this like for about four or five tries, it's so awesome to get 310 exotics because I can go and infuse them with my raid gear or anything else. Oh, and then this one is pretty cool. Um, I pretty much came up with this spot myself. Uh, that doesn't mean that I came up with it first it's just I stumbled upon it and I want to share it with you guys uh, so it's, you just enter this and you go all the way to the left it's like the Taken or whatever this is big ass Minotaur and uh, or the little Atheon dude <laughs> and you just come over here and you get behind these crates and he can barely hit you and I'm using the Iron Banner Pulse Rifle it does wonders in this and uh, what I have is the fourth horseman, so my teammate is going to stand right next to me. So when he pops that bubble, I'm just going to use a fourth horseman and get us both out of it. And he, that way he can have a sniper rifle. Um, and we're only doing this with two people. Keep that in mind, guys. Imagine if you guys had three people, this could be even faster. That's why I give it a time of six to eight minutes. I'm sure you guys that are just pros out there, you guys can do it in five minutes. But hey, that's a pretty good trade-off to be able to do all of this in just five minutes. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get an exotic drop in what you're seeing on the screen, but hey, we're done with it. Here's the treasure room. I get a treasure key. I got some motes of light. I get, and then boom, open it up and I get strange coins. But you guys keep in mind, you can get strange coins from the left and right chest. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. A thumbs up would help so much. Please do beatbox that thumbs up button. Join the TKO gaming family by hitting that subscribe button. I'll see you guys in more videos and raid guides for the hard mode coming up this Friday. Look in the description below for all the links to connect with us more. Peace out. Stay blessed.